up? What's good? What's going on? Welcome back to the War Zone once again. Let's talk a little bit about this clown, Roly Romero. So we all know that a couple weeks ago, Roly Romero was viciously knocked out in the sixth round against Javante Davis. And since then, he has been running around like he is the pay-per-view star of the future, people. Um, he's clowning his fans about how they lost money on him, how he lost money on himself. And how a lot of people are homeless right now because of him. Leading up to the fight, man, he was uh, urging people to bet their mortgage on him and that he would not let himself down. Just a complete, complete clown. Uh, a lot of smack talk went on leading up to that fight. And none of it paid off in the ring. Okay, you Javante Davis, as we all know, man, is uh, just on another level. Highly skilled. Used his timing to catch R R Roly Romero with a beautiful shot, man, that ended the fight. And for some reason, um, Roly Romero was running around saying he's the best promoter in the business. But uh, see, this is what I'm talking about. Uh, the mentality of a lot of these young kids coming up in boxing and this is what you don't want to do You want to mature become professional man. Um, after all this is a business your life is on the line and It's just it's not about running your mouth You know, um, I mean before you start running your mouth um, get somewhere get established um, But anyway, man, um Roly also put out a video of him at, a, at some club somewhere, drunk, out of his mind, just saying the dumbest stuff that you can possibly imagine, and um, I'm going to leave a clip for that. You're broke now because of me, so am I. I literally gambled my entire damn check because I'm stupid, but it, it don't matter. Look, I'm gonna tell you like this. That, that, that's all money none of us needed anyway. <laughs> I ain't need the money, none of us need the money. Rolly, I went bankrupt. <laughs> I did too. Rolly, I'm homeless. But you know what? I'm gonna make it all up to y'all. When y'all wanna bet again, I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, hey, hey, uh, I'm, 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 I'm a little, I'm a little, I'm a little tipsy right now. I'm a little tipsy right now. But 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 I'm happy. I'm having a good time. Every day is my birthday. Today's my birthday. Uh, 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 it is it's June. Oh wait, wait June 13th. June 13th. June 12th, my birthday is June 12th, everybody tell me happy birthday, all I want my birthday is a big, a big booty, uh, I, uh, as you can see people, none of this makes sense, and um, actually when does it, but um, like I said man, just nonsense, um, it's a social media uh, fiasco now with a lot of these fighters uh, you know including Ryan Garcia with his social media campaign that um, is just basically going to get him nowhere where it's going to yield the same results as uh, what happened to Roland Romero man just mark my words people because it has nothing to do with skill, man. It's just, it's just talk, trying to get a big, big payday because you know you lack the skills to really uh, have any longevity in the sport. So this is what we're going to be dealing with, man.
So that's all I really got for you, man. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe to the channel with the bell icon for notifications. And uh, peace and blessings to all. And I'm out.